Should I just hold up all my red, white, and blue clothing because that's all I got? Like, 4th of July haul. We Hey guys, it's Lisa. So in today's video, I'm gonna... I hate that intro. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a back to school try on clothing haul. I recently picked up some items that I wanted to share with you guys that are very like fall back to schoolish. Most of these pieces fit in the back to school dress code. I did go to like a high school that had a semi strict dress code, so I know what that's like. And these pieces pretty much fit in there. I'm not actually going to high school this year. Thank God, but if you guys are like looking for inspiration to that, then you could definitely use these pieces towards there. So without further ado, let's just hop on into the haul video and let's get started. I like how I start with the item that you probably can't wear back to school. How, how ironic, like this is just a white shirt that looks like this and it ties in the front. I thought this would look really good on the fall time with like a nice pair of jeans in the city, you know. I always like whenever I buy stuff, I have to like plan out an outfit around that around it. Does anyone else do that? Because I feel like I always do that. Also, my hair is everywhere. I feel like a lion. I feel like Hagrid from Harry Potter because this is my natural hair and it just kind of like poofs everywhere. The next thing I also got from PacSun, this is just a periwinkle blue color. I love that word. And it's just like a t-shirt. I'm not going to need to dress up for any of my classes this first semester. So I need more like athleisure and comfy like sweatpants and stuff, which I don't own, which really is kicking me in the butt because all through high school I would buy like semi dressy things and never get like comfy clothes. So now I'm wasting my entire bank account on comfy clothes that I now need to purchase. Zara jeans are amazing, especially like the mom jeans they make. And they're always on sale. So for example, like these were only $16, which is a steal for jeans. So I picked this pair of black mom jeans up. They look like this. Super cute, just a basic pair of mom jeans that are black. I've been really into mom jeans lately instead of wearing like just like tight skinny jeans. And then, you know, since I love mom jeans so much, I got a pair in white. These ones are button up instead of zip up, which I actually kind of prefer the zip up kind, but I'm not complaining. I will wear these so much and they're both like the mom fit, which I really like because I guess I just like looking like a mother. So call me mother Lisa. You know, following along with the red, white and blue theme, these are actually, they're red, white and blue because that's like Tommy Hilfiger colors. I got a pair of sweatpants from there. They're the kind that get like tighter at the bottom, but these fit so nice and are so comfortable. When I tried them on in the fitting room, I was like, I really need to get these because they just fit really nicely. And then I've been really, like I said, into like athleisure lately, like just like sporty clothes because that's what all I'm gonna wear to classes, like t-shirts and like sporty clothes and like sweatpants, sweatshirts, stuff like that. So I went to Fila and I never actually gotten anything from Fila before, but I really like it because it's red, white, and blue, like, like my obsession right now. So I got this pair of shorts, which are so cute. I just think these look so nice. And I actually am think I'm going to need to put these in the wash because Fila's like sizing is a little weird for me, like especially in the shorts. The extra small is too small and then the small is too big. So there's no in between so I think just to fix that I'm just gonna throw these in the washer and then put them on high in the dryer just to like shrink them a little bit but they're really nice and just have the band on the side that says feel the band for this is super thick though thick and then the second pair of shorts I got were just a black pair because I don't own like a pair of black like running shorts so these I just thought would be good to wear to class this looks like something you'd find in like Brandy Melville it's just a crew neck long sleeve t-shirt and it also has right here like mid sleeve it has just this design that's blue and red stripe my entire closet is basically red white and blue so i'm gonna look like a bomb pop 24 7 to be honest i got these pants which if you watched my last vlog video, which I'll link that down below, you know, <laughs> go check it out. I wore these pants to an event I went to in Soho and they were so comfy and I got so many compliments on these pants because they look exactly like the IMGA pants, which I really want, but they're also like $90 and I really don't want to spend that much on a pair of like cargo pants. 
So this is what they look like. They're just red and they're cargo. They're really good quality. I really like the fit of these pants. They do run really big, so I actually got an extra small in these, which I'm usually like a small. So if you're going to order these, just get a size down than you normally would, just so it fits like nice and tight around the waist. But yeah, these are super like Instagram baddie pants. Like... I like them a lot. The last thing I got from Forever 21 is this blouse. It's just one of those wrap blouses that I've been really in for like this upcoming fall. And it's going to be really hard to see what it looks like. So you'll see it on in the try on portion. But it's super cute and I like the whole like um, this type of color combination. It's very fall and something I don't own a lot of. The store is amazing. The prices are insane. Like I walk in there and I'm actually blown away by how cheap things are in that store. This is super cute. I feel like this also looks like a Brandy Melville like inspired t-shirt, but it's just a quarter length zip up. Quarter length zip up? Is that what it's even called? But it's just like a little cute t-shirt that looks very back to school and I just think it's so cute for like the end of summertime, early fall. And yeah cute 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 next two things i got these are basic items but stuff that i will wear so much so they're just these t-shirts so the first one i got is just a white one and it just buttons right here and it's like a lower v-neck i thought this would look really nice with a bralette peeking through so i got this color they're also really soft so this is just white and then since I'm obsessed with it, I got it in gray too. They also have black, which I might go back and get because they're so cheap. These were $7, like $7. And they're pretty good quality and very soft and comfortable. So I picked up those two. Like I was saying with the whole, like, I don't own, like, any comfy clothes. I got some from Primark because they're cheap and, like, I can just get so much stuff like this. So the first thing I got was just a black jumper. And this would just go with like sweatpants. Like if I want to get a pair of like red sweatpants with like the stripe down the side, like that's a look. I thought this would look good to just like throw on on top because it's very soft. If you've seen that like look around where it's like a giant sweatshirt and then you wear like Doc Martens. I have Doc Martens that I actually got like four years ago and was going to throw them out because I thought they were like out of style. But now they're like coming back in style. So I'm like, okay, I saved myself $120 because I can rewear those in now because I thought they were like never going to come back in. Does this make me look like a giant pumpkin? Yes. But is it a kind of a look? Yes, it kind of works. I got this bralette. It was on sale, which is a really good deal. And I don't own many bralettes. I need to get more, but it's just like your average basic white bralette. They were having a deal on their sunglasses. So me and my mom actually got the same pair. <laughs> I think they're so nice. I love sunglasses. I have an obsession with all different types of sunglasses. So I thought these were really nice and they're very reflectant. Can you see like my makeshift tripod, how I'm using like a bureau right now or like my nightstand? Yeah, it's a little strange. But yeah, I just thought these were like really nice. They were having a deal on their tube tops and I, all this summer, all I've been wearing is tube tops every day. Just tube tops every single day because they're so easy to wear. And I feel like especially for school, you can still get away with wearing them if you wear a cardigan over it if you're not allowed to show your shoulders which d just saying is the stupidest rule I've ever heard like sorry my shoulder is offending you so the first tube top I got from there since they were having a deal was just a plain black one this is unessential I've got so much wear out of this even though I like just got it and then the next tube top I got is a uh, red white and blue and yeah, it just looks like this. Super cute. I actually had a photo shoot in this top and it looked really good. You know, contrast red, white, and blue, like red shorts, denim jacket, a look. And that is pretty much everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. So yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. And yeah, bye.